Welcome to 14 Karambi Street. It's a second story apartment, but you enter right here off the street level into this foyer. There's a stairway right here um, that brings you down to the basement, which where is where there's shared laundry access. <clears throat> this is probably one of my favorite apartments that we have because it's got lots of character and fun features. So you come up the foyer stairway and you have this landing here which leads out to a cute little sun porch. So that's kind of fun. And then coming back through at the top of the stairs, here's the entrance to the apartment. And you come into this nice large room with bay windows. This is generally like a living room area. This room here, you can leave open. There's two two doors, right? Or you can close it off and just have one door open. But this is a bedroom. Often people close this one door. Right? But if you want, you can leave it wide open. If you don't need all three bedrooms, this is a great common area space too. But otherwise, you come through the living room area here, and then this is typically used as like a dining room. There's, those are storage cabinets and pantry, and there's another storage closet in there too. So this apartment has really good storage, especially considering how big it is. So yeah, that's the view looking in that way. Kitchen is right off here. So refrigerator, gas range, and then sink and cabinets over there. There's a sweet little old fashioned pantry in here too. So lots of extra counter space and storage. Little window, sometimes people put a butcher block or something over here for a little extra counter space. That's the kitchen. And then off the kitchen here, you come into the bathroom. I'll just orient you a little bit. Yeah. So this is an interesting bathroom because it's railroad style. So you can, there's two doors. One connects to this bedroom, which is off the living room at the top of the stairs where we came in. Right? And often people just kind of keep this door closed off and access the bathroom from the other side, which is here. But tile, shower, cute little window. And then you come back through the kitchen. Through the dining room, through the living room. This is the first bedroom, and then this is the second bedroom. Right, that's the bathroom door. Closet there. And yeah, good little space in here. Um, I'll take you up the spiral stairs, which bring you to the upstairs bedroom suite. It's really large and has good bonus space. So you come up the stairs and that is kind of typically where people lay out their sleeping furniture, bed and clothes storage. And then over here is a fun little nook that people have used for like music or office or just a lounge area. Skylight, which is kind of fun. 
And then there's a half bathroom, which is really convenient to have up here and it's nice, it has a skylight. And then through here is a huge, huge walk-in closet with windows. So tons of awesome closet storage. So yeah, I'll bring you back through. Maybe I'll go all the way down and give you a look from this direction too. All right. Go back downstairs. And there you have it. Three bedroom, one bath, plus a half bath. And there's a shared uh, yard in the back. <laughs>